Hello, I'm about to leave uh, for two months. So this is kind of it. So I figured I'd just make a little update video for you lot. Because it's been quite a hectic... I bit my tongue. Oh, f ah. It's been quite a hectic few weeks. Oh, man, that was actually so sh oh. So, I've just spent the past two weeks in a small room rehearsing this show that I'm about to do around America. But before that, I had surgery. On my balls. I don't know if you know this, if you've been following me for the past few months, but I've had a few issues with the crown jewels. So I had to get those fixed, you know, they kept kind of just twisting and, uh, you know, nearly destroying me. So I got that fixed. Let me tell you, surgery... It's pretty scary. I went into that room and I was just shuddering like a dog in a vet. But you know what? They put me under. They sent me to sleep. They, they drugged me. And I wake up in the middle of this room, like properly freaked out, you know, with a new set of balls. I was so out of it. And I think I made some of the doctors laugh. I was doing like bits because I think I assumed I was in like a video of some sort or doing some lore. The only thing I remember doing is coming downstairs and handing the doctor my phone and going, film my TikTok. Please, because that's the grind never stops, you know, even when you're getting ripped apart. It just never, never stops for me. Because that's, that's the kind of, that, the hit. Uh, a few days after, I had a few days where I was so, so tired. I couldn't, like, move. Genuinely, I'm going to say this to you now, every step I took, you know, just take, just felt like I was getting punched in the butt, like, every step. So it was a really challenging few days. I even did a Twitch stream where I kind of don't really remember, because I've not gone back and watched the VOD either, because I was pretty fucking out of it during that stream still. I still had, like, the drugs in my system, and I was like... Anyway, so, um, the good thing about the rest that I had is that I didn't have enough of it. It, that, I guess that wasn't a good thing. I immediately had to get into the rehearsals for the show. If you don't know, I'm leaving for America for two months to perform my How to Billion... To, how to, to perform my How to Billion... Oh, fuck me, man. <laughs> to perform my How to Be a Billionaire show for two months. It's just like what I did in England, but like it's that same show, but with more scenes and better and more songs and funnier. So I had to rehearse that and get right into that. You know, wow. Everything was hurting. I still was kind of drugged up. So we start doing that and I'll be honest the first few days are looking really bad Because I can't do any of the moving and if you know me and you've seen the show around England You know, I do a lot of jokes jumping around and you know, I get physical with it So I was very worried for the first few days Finally, I started being able to move around again and I could like stand up and do jokes And then I could like run across the stage and before I knew it I was back in my full form and the rehearsals went amazingly, you know uh, Just like every day going in and going over jokes and going could this be funny memorizing the lines doing everything, making it like as funny as it fucking can be. I really enjoyed that. Like, I, I really enjoy that. And I love just going over jokes. Dude, you have no idea how long I spent in 2020 drafting tweets about women. I, it was it was sad, actually. I've always loved this. But it's even better doing it and knowing you're actually going to see it in person and I'll fucking hear you laughing, you know? That's so sick. And then about midway through rehearsals... Nothing else happened that made it harder or more upsetting or a worse week. And I'm doing fine. I'm doing. F I'm. I'm doing. I'm actually. I'm. Do I'm actually. But I'm doing. F <sighs> so then that came to the end of the week of rehearsals, and I've just been. I'm so knackered. I'm so tired, dude. Like this is probably the most down to earth tired you you'll ever see me. But I'm so fucking excited because these next two months I'm going around America, like seeing the world, man. What does Pittsburgh even look like? Do you know what I mean? I can't. I can't even imagine that in my head. I, I have so many days there to just like explore and like, dude. I'm. This is my. This is like even in 2020, you know, I could never have imagined this. Even when I hit 10 million subs, I thought that was that. Like it can't get any cooler than that. And here I am, about to travel the world. So that's fucking. Oh mate. <laughs> It is mad. It really is. And as well as doing that, I get to go on stage and see you lot and make you lot laugh. And I, I've been doing, like, lots of comedy gigs stand-up all the time now. And I found that I, I really like doing this. So I'm very excited to see you lot. Those of you that are coming, I really hope you do enjoy the show. Because we have spent so much time on it. And look, if you are in America or you're, like, thinking of coming to the show, anyone in England can vouch for it. It was fucking awesome. I can safely say now that after spending the past two weeks on it, going through fucking thick, you meant to say thick and thin, thick and even thicker, that, mate, this has came out the other end and it is so good, man. The scenes we've added, the stuff we've added, the actual story, like, I talk about, you know, like, getting doxxed and shit that I've never talked about on the internet before, but saying it to you, like, in person, is so like cool. I, I'm, I really want you lot to hear it. And also the jokes. Like I'm not being funny. It is the funniest thing I've made in the past like three, four years, man. It's so like if you like laughing, if you want to come and have a proper night of laughing, see those in person. Fucking come along. I don't even know what some. Like let me just have a fucking look. My mate 
What is Phoenix? I, I, what is? What even is this? I'm going here. I'm going to all these places. I don't even know. What is this, man? I'm actually going here. It looks like fucking Breaking Bad. Ra rally. This is amazing. Columbus, Ohio. I don't even know. This is so mad. Oh, like, there's all these places and new lot that I'm going to meet and shit I'm going to see. Dude, I am so excited. I'm so fucking excited. So if you're at any of those cities, please do get a ticket. Uh, I promise. I promise you. I swear on my life. It's not going to let you down, okay? Bring your mates if you want. You'll fucking love it. And yes, people took the piss out of that video of us dancing on TikTok, all right? But you know what? The joke was... Oh, I'm not being funny. The joke was that we were dancing. People took the piss out of us dancing. The joke, you lot, is that I spent like five days learning how to do this dance. And I can do the whole thing while retaining eye contact with you, okay? And I learned how to do this dance because why the hell wouldn't I? What's not funny about learning how to do a dance for no fucking reason? And everyone was like, oh, the whole show was this. The whole show is just them dancing. Don't give Minecraft YouTubers a show. Fuck you, man. I'm the best Minecraft YouTuber in the game. Well, so Techno is, but he hasn't been up learning recently. Anyway, uh, yeah, come, come along. <laughs> I just thought I'd make this little update video for you all. I am still going to be uploading weekly on this channel. I did spend like two weeks before rehearsals filming nine videos because I'm not going to let you lot down. Do you know what I mean? You lot are fucking sick. I got a film. I got pre film those videos. And I've got streams lined up while I'm out in America with Technoblade's dad, Ludwig, Logan Paul, maybe. We might do a stream on his private jet, which I would really like, but that. We'll see. Anyway, it's going to be fucking amazing. I'm so, so excited and so grateful that you lot are like, you know, I couldn't do any of it. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm out of breath on the dance. <laughs> I couldn't have done any of this shit without you lot, uh, you know, believing in me and watching me and sticking with me through the years. I could never thank you enough. So I'm not even going to try to. I'll just make my YouTube videos for you and try and make them as best as I can. <laughs> Guys, I appreciate it so much. Appreciate you sticking with me. And uh, mate, if you come to the show, I can't wait for you to see it. Anyway, you lot, I'll be back here in two months. And this whole room is going to change when I'm back, by the way. This whole room's getting like a redesign. This whole desk, everything, it's gonna be so much better. Um, so fuck, man. All right, well, see you later. Have a good one, guys. In a bit.